Good afternoon, friends. I'm Matt Williams. I'm the director here at Skylake, and it's great to have you here with us on our final Friday hike of August and our final Friday hike. And I'll give you some more updates about our updated hiking schedule toward the tail end of our time today. But I am kind of kneeling down near a little inlet leading into Sky Lake proper. And as I was coming out here a little while ago, came across some acorns in the water. And also, um, I should have gone back and gotten my hard hat. Luckily, none hit me. But as I was standing here on the bridge, just a little past North 3, and I look up above, it's now subsequently moved on, but right over in this area, there was a squirrel way up at the top of the oak tree, shaking off a bunch of acorns that came plummeting down through the hemlock tree right in front of us like a pinball machine. It was pretty cool. Um, a little, little disconcerting because it was like, okay, where is the acorn going to land? And it turned out several landed in the water or right near the water. And probably when I move on, if the squirrel remembers, they'll come back and collect some of those acorns and put them in storage for winter. But we are still in the middle of summer. And so we are going to go on a little adventure. We've taken this path uh, earlier this spring when there was not as much growth around here. And I made sure to put on my wellies because this is going to be a wet hike today. And I also made sure to apply some bug repellent so I don't attract any of those favorite uh, little um, bugs to come and visit. But we have gotten some gnarly rainstorms this summer, including a nice thunderstorm that kept coming and coming and coming yesterday afternoon and early evening. And so we do have some running water. Um, not as much rain as a couple of those storms we've gotten this summer. The lake is at a decent level uh, for today, but wanted to bring you back out into this segment and see what it's like when there's water moving this time of year. And also to show you what the, uh, a couple weeks ago I made reference to Willa Sharp Kilmer's fish hatchery. And so that's coming right up on our little adventure. So let's go up through the trees. You can see right here, there is the old well that he, wall that he used uh, to dam up some water. And some of us remember way back when coming back through here and doing mud hikes. It gets very, very muddy back here. Um, and we determined at one point that it uh, wasn't really safe to bring campers back here anymore. But, you know, as we learn more, we do better. And so that's where this was. But I love the sound of that water coming through the old fish hatchery wall. Like, can we just build a lodge right here and, uh, you know, listen to this all day and also wanted to show you that we clearly received a, a lightning strike nearby recently that, that looks pretty fresh i don't know if that happened yesterday or one of the thunderstorms before but that is quite gnarly fun all right let's keep hiking up through here
as we go along this path. We're hiking up behind North 3, and this will eventually lead us to uh, the, the path up to our East Shore ball field. Not sure we're going to be able to make it all the way there today, but let's do this adventure. And it's very muddy and boggy back here. And that is why I'm really glad that I put my, my wellies on. Hi, Sherry. Thanks for tuning in. Ah, so we're coming up a tree, not sure, um, and I'm going to be able to <laughs> climb over one-handed, so I may come up here where I know we have a little bit better service, and ooh, check out these ferns, aren't they beautiful? Right, well, friends... This is where we're going to end this portion of our, our adventure. Hopefully we'll be able to pick it up again another day. And beginning next week, it's September. And with September, we have made the decision to continue doing our uh, virtual mini hikes twice a week. And we're going to do those on Tuesdays and Thursdays. And we're going to shift the start time just a little bit earlier at 1 p.m. Eastern time. So Tuesdays and Thursdays, beginning September 1st at 1 p.m. Eastern Time. So we look forward to having you continue tuning in and joining us for these mini hikes around Sky Lake. They're always fun to take you along on these little adventures. And be sure to also join us for our Sunday campfire this Sunday at 7.30 p.m. Eastern right here at facebook.com slash Skylake Center. And we can't wait to spend some time with you on Sunday and then next Tuesday and Thursday. Until then, friends, take care and get outside. Bye-bye.